And with that, it's time for us to take a look at the weather this Friday. My colleague Divya joins us with the latest. Thank you so much, Maya. Monsoon's finally picking up in the south. Therefore, the deficit that had reached 22% has started to slip. It has managed to rain substantially so in some parts, especially like Kerala. And therefore, this deficit has now come down to about 20%. In certain parts of the country, rainfall will start to show up like it has been in Vidharb and Maratwada. Will this shortage be up for improvement? Yes, we are certainly hopeful. But the east and the northeast has been disappointing beyond belief. In fact, it is just slipping by the day. It's coming in at 13%. As far as the north is concerned, the profit here now seems to be washing off. In fact, uh, that's what uh, the situation is like. And the overall picture comes in at 9%. Now, areas like uh, Tamil Nadu, Himachal Pradesh, Uttar Pradesh, all these areas are the states where onions are produced. And we have seen that the price has gone up. And that's thanks to the excess amount of rains that we've seen in these areas, or in fact, the lack of it. So both these uh, situations, the unreliability, also excess rain, which has caused a spike in uh, transportation is the reason behind the prices of onions going up. Now let's just take into account what the month of August is looking like. We can expect a 90% of the rains that we usually get, so a 10% deficit. If you combine August and September, that's an 84%, and this could have a margin error of about 9%. And as far as a whole uh, season is concerned here, we expect it to be about 12% deficit. That's what we're expecting at the end of September. Now let's just take into account that uh, the way it's been in the last two months, we've seen that June started off on a really good note but July has been really bad and in case you thought that it rains the most in the month of July you're right because July does get in the maximum amount of rains the second rainiest month is August and just in case you thought that it rains more in June than it does in September you're wrong September does get in more showers and what is it going to be like on Independence Day if you have any plans to be in and around Delhi it's likely to be raining tonight tomorrow as well as uh, by Sunday we it's likely to start clearing out it's going to be cloudy from there on but tomorrow on Independence Day we can expect some showers that's the latest on the bulletin stay with us lots more coming up on the other side.